Good morning, David. Good morning. How are you coping? I'm good. I'm keeping myself busy writing. Has your son inherited your talent for writing? He's coming up with ideas for stories all the time. I mean, they come thick and fast. So he's really into that, really into stories. Mm. Um, he tends to choose other writers rather than me. <laughs> um, so we're going to talk about um, the Commonwealth Essay Writing Competition. Brilliant theme this year, which is the environment. You can tell it by poetry, you can write an essay, you can write a story. Really be as imaginative as you can. There's millions of children that could potentially enter this competition. They have got uh, a chance, haven't they, until June to, uh, to submit their stories online at the Royal Commonwealth Society website. I actually launched it in, in New Zealand this year. Well, it wasn't, it was, God, I've lost track of time. It was last year, uh, the year before I launched it in Ghana. And it's, it's very interesting, the response I had. The entries after, oh, you know, after I was able to say something about it, they doubled. So that was very exciting. Oh. I hope this year they might have trebled and quadrupled. But it's never a better time, I think, to be writing or reading than this time. And I find, personally, that when I do creative work, it passes the time beautifully. We just want lots and lots and lots of these aspiring young writers to enter, because, you know, as you said before, some of their stories really are verging on brilliant, aren't they? They're, they're brilliant. And I know that this theme is really going to get them going, so I can't wait to read the entries. Thank you.